today we're wrapping the stacks. This is 100% fiberglass. I wrapped the first one with just the gloves and a regular shirt on and now I'm covered in fiberglass and I'm all itchy even though it was wet. You can, you can see the flakes coming off of this thing. I marked where I'm going to be putting it. I have a regular tie strap to begin with because these metal straps really suck to work with. So get it in place and get it tight with a regular one, get it totally done and then come back and finish it off with the straps. This is a 50 foot roll of exhaust wrap. Reason I'm, wrap, I'm wrapping it is um, I don't want to put heat shields on it. It doesn't really get that hot. It gets about 200, 230 degrees. So I'm only going to wrap what is touchable to small hands. I'm wrapping up until the bracket and the bracket is about eye level. So hopefully this will cut it down enough to not burn someone. I don't, I don't think it gets hot enough to, to melt skin. You know, like that. Definitely does not get hot enough to do damage like that. So this, this is just a piece of mine. I am going from the bottom up because it will make my laps. As it makes that lap, we want it running down um, just for rainwater, wind. We don't want it going upwards. We don't want it to have any reason to fray. If you're wrapping a bike or any other exhaust that would be going sideways, this would keep the wind from, from fraying the ends. Make sure you wrap it in the forward direction. The way the stack is facing right now is how it's gonna face on the outside of the bus. So I wanna make this side the pretty side and then make all my folds and zip ties on the back side. So to start that, I'm gonna fold it, but I'm gonna fold the lip down. We have a wrappable side and we have a not wrappable side. See how one side looks different than the other? This is gonna be the side that you want exposed. So I'm gonna flip it. Mm -hmm. I'm doing it about a quarter inch or a half an inch of a lap. So the reason we put it in water, you put it in water, one, it's gonna help with the fiberglass. All the flakes from the cloth is gonna help keep it down. And second, and probably more important, is it will shrink when it's dry. So if you wrap it nice and tight while it's wet, and then let it dry off or heat it up, turn, turn your exhaust on, turn your engine on. It'll shrink it down and make it even tighter. Luckily I'm wrapping a straight pipe, so I'm not having too many difficulties, but when you're working with curves, you'll notice on the bottom, you, got, you can see it down here, how it's how it kind of starts to do that. If you're working with curves, you might have to fold it here and, and try to work it underneath the lap. So you gotta pay attention to all your curves. But luckily, I have none, so this isn't super difficult. I'll be wrapping the CRF, the dirt bike exhaust, because it keeps burning Amber's leg. So hopefully the uh, exhaust wrap will come in soon and I'll be experienced enough to do a good job on the dirt bike. These are the cable ties it comes with. They're, uh, they're stainless, real similar to zip tie. Ooh, almost messed it up. But since this, this four inch pipe, it is too large just to do one, so we're tying them together. Doing it kind of where it's not gonna be seen. These are tricky. I wasted a lot of these. But you wanna cut it. This is gonna be the visible side. This is gonna be the side closest to the road. I'm gonna roll it inwards and clamp it down. 
try to do that one or two times and then I'm gonna do it to the opposite side this one I'm gonna pull a lot tighter yeah so that's not moving now pushing up pushing down it's pretty tight so we're gonna cut it cut the zip tie I'm wrapping two on each top and bottom. This is the front stack. This is gonna be taking the blunt of all the elements, the rain, the wind, and everything. So I'm gonna make sure that this is uh, strapped down real well. We're doing two and two. So that's literally a wrap on this video guys um, smash that like button smash that subscribe button I swear it doesn't go unnoticed we love it when we get your feedback so show us some love guys